Hello, my name's David. I'm the author of The Simple Truth About You. It's a book of self-discovery and self-awareness and a way to understand yourself differently and bring peace and meaning to your life. So if that's something that you're looking for, well, perhaps there's something in there for you. So it took me about a year to write and after time and time again editing the book, this is all I was left with. It's not something that I could sell, not something that people want to So of course I need to get it published. So I didn't bother thinking about that whilst writing the book, so now it's time to think about it. So I started to look on the internet for publishing houses and you know, I thought that would be easy for me, but it's not. It seems that, you know, you can send your manuscript off into oblivion and perhaps they'll get back to you and perhaps they won't. So if you're willing to just sit around and wait for that, well, good luck to you. So self-publishing seemed to be the only answer. So as everyone else, you know, probably does, but on the internet, searching and searching and searching. It took me about two or three months to find in-house eventually. And most of these other companies were concerned with how much money they could make me and how many places they could sell the book. But I didn't have a book yet. So the most important thing to me was to get something solid and concrete and finished. So right from the get-go, you know, my conversation in-house, it was all about what they could do for me. It was about getting my project to fruition, not about trying to glitz and glamour themselves and tell me all the stuff they could do for me. About just simply putting your book together. So for me that was a great bit of final what I've been looking for. So you know the process was very easy. Just simple, plain, understandable steps, small steps, one at a time, leading you to completion. I found that, you know, the underlying tone was, are you happy with this? Most of the time, yes, I was. A request too big or too small, nothing too hard to do. I had final say, I had control over everything. And really, the whole experience was pretty enjoyable. I learned a lot. You know, I don't know whether I'll write again or got anything else to say. But if I do, in-house would be the way I'd go. You know, for me being local, being in Australia, well, you know, I'm someone who's used to face-to-face -face business, so, you know, it's only a short flight to see them if I need to resolve anything. You know, most of these other in publication companies are in the States or Canada or UK, and, you know, just pay them the money and then whatever happens, happens. It's out of your control. But, um, yeah, what can I say? In-house, I had a great time. And, you know, thanks very much, Ocean, for all your patience. I, mean, I don't know if I'm more difficult than others. Perhaps, perhaps not. But anyway, finally, you brought my dream together. And uh, I couldn't have done it without you. It's money well spent. And, you know, by the time the book's finished, it's even on the internet ready to go. So that's great. Um, you know, the hard work's still there for me to do to promote it, but I know that everything's there when I need to fall back on printing and any more editing or advice. So, good stuff in-house, and thank you the whole in-house team for everything you've done for me, and uh, perhaps we'll meet again on the next book.